babies, welcome back. Today we're going to be continuing our monster anime reactions. So far we got Tenma. He had 12 on, on like shit. 12 was ready to lock this nigga up over a tie. It wasn't even any like any, any like what was it hard cold evidence. It was no evidence pointing at this nigga and, and niggas is on his dick. So he had to flee because his bitch wife of an ex fiance or wife whatever who the fuck that bitch was to him. It's been nine, ten years too. And then Nina ran away. Johan is still out there. Nina's still out there. So he dipped. So we're going to see where the fuck we at now. Because last thing I remember was he dipped from the hospital. Because feel me, if, 12 was, if there's 20 cops chasing you in your occupation, wouldn't you dip too? I'm out. Okay, let's start. Uh, it looks like another scorcher today. Hey, why are you all bundled up on a hot summer day like this? Aren't you broiling? Huh? You're reading an old paper. That one's at least three days old. How you yeah, know? Yeah, a couple in Verdon got themselves murdered. They say a doctor did it, if you can believe that. Oh, wow. Hey, buddy, They're you not said they you blaming were him for murders? Isn't that right? What, you know somebody over there? Yeah, I do. That nigga looks not old. Even sure that picture don't even look now. remotely different from the one in the newspaper. Get the I have to try and find him. Blick, blicky, let's skip this. Blicky, 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 blicky. Okay, so this is how we... So we kind of at this part in the intro where, like, you know, he got the stubble, not really seeing a big difference. Nina's grown up. Wife. That's the detective that's on his dick. That's Johan. I don't know who that other boy was. I saw that other boy. That's the okay. That was Johan as a little kid. I'm guessing. I feel like we met everybody that we need to meet, and now we just let the story unfold. Except that creepy dude that who was in the dark. Yeah, see, there's a lot going on. I don't know. I feel like we at the part of the intro now where he's like walking around and trying to figure out how to clear his name. But honestly, I would have. I would have just got the world's best lawyer because ain't no way you about to pin this on me. That detective would have lost his job at the end of the goddamn year. She bored as shit. I don't get playing in the rain. I used to hate playing in the rain. It's cold. It's windy. It's wet. Like... She doing that shit over and over again in front of a police station? Formerly served in the French Foreign Legion. Then went freelance and fought in Nicaragua in 1979. From 1981 to 1984 assisted the guerrilla rebels in Afghanistan. Then in 1987 you played a key role in the assassination of radical Islamic leaders in a top secret Mossad operation. Okay. It's like quite an impressive resume, I like must this. admit. Isn't it, Mr. Hugo Bernhardt? You ugly as shit. I have no doubt that a mercenary of your you caliber like must be quite Wall a teacher. And I'm sure a number world. of distinguished men must have been under your instruction. <laughs> it might be a good idea to send some of our own officers to attend your seminar and have you whip them into shape. Yeah, that'd be great. Incidentally, was this man here a good student by any chance? I believe he showed up at your training grounds about five months ago. They on his ass like that? We know that he is a genius with a scalpel. What I'm wondering about is whether he has any talent with a gun. But I gotta protect myself, did I you not? I don't divulge information about my pupils to anyone, period. Respect. Respect. Of course you don't. Yo, she's top five annoying right now. There's no way you're still having fun. All right, she having the time of her fucking life. Trees. Oh, look at the squirrel. Look how he drew them. Oh, bye. Five, five weeks, months, days. So have days. you ever trained with a gun before? Five months uh, ago. 
No. I guess that means that you're self-taught, then. Actually, I've never shot a gun before. Get the fuck mm. out of my farm. What, you mean not even once? Right. Nah. I know I'm asking for the impossible. I'm a virgin. That said, you're my only hope right now. Hmm. It makes no difference. I make all my students forget everything they learned before they got here. But this... <laughs> This is the first time I'll be teaching someone who's never shot a gun before. What's that they carry in a moth? Oh, he looks so depressed. The fact that this is detective, this is the world's worst detective. The fact that this detective is all eyes on ten months is rope. crazy. Regardless of your experience or lack of, this is where everyone starts. Now jump like that child over there. Okay. That's easy. You can do it. She she learned how to get the blicky too. She she Don't learned just it. Stand there. Well, get started. Uh, yes, sir. You, she learned it? Okay. You, you teach all ages. Respect. Okay, come on, Tamara. You all lousy with it. Weak as fuck with it. Faster now. Hurry it up. Right. Like, come on. Chop, chop. Come on. Yeah. I said faster. No wonder your wife balance. left it's you. It's all about balance. What does this guy do with a gun? Never mind. I don't know how to use a gun. Come on, faster. I said faster. He made him do this for days. The music? Oh. 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 <sighs> Well, obviously, I can't jump rope nearly as well as you do. Tell me something, rope, rope. Tell me something. Tell me something, rope. You know, always he gotta get his balance down so he can use his blicky. All right, I understand. You don't have to keep on staring. Tell me something, rope. I'll do it. So he can get balance for <laughs> his blicky. For his blicky. For his blicky. <laughs> I'm dumb as shit. I ain't gonna hold you. Oh. Da, da, hey, it's a brandling. Da, da, da. To I wonder if it's looking for food for its chicks. So he can get his blicky. To me gets the rope. So he can... Train with the blicky, 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 what the blicky, 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 do the blicky dance. Tell me be jumping rope. <laughs> all right, all right. Good job. <laughs> I didn't even pay attention to that scene. I'm so sorry. I know he's talking to that girl. He, she ain't say shit back. That looks good. What's that, Salisbury steak? You done made fat me a TV dinner, messed his coat of fuck in the middle. What's wrong? Are you too tired to eat? Uh, I eat that boy. Yes. You can't train if you pass out. Yes, sir. How is this little girl outdoing you in everything? Shorty cleaned her plate. Cleared by me new bangs. Oh. She your daughter? Or your granddaughter, maybe? Neither. Okay. That little girl is the daughter of a woman I killed. Oh. Shot her down right before her very eyes. Back in Myanmar. Oh, shit. 
On mission in the jungle, I ran into a hut for shelter. And there she was with her mother. Whoa. Why did you shoot her? Her mother was holding a gun. If I'd have been a fraction of a second slower, it would have been me that died that day. I brought the child back here with me. I couldn't just leave her. From that moment on, she hasn't smiled once. Damn. That's why she'll probably hate me for the rest of her life. Are you teaching her how to use a gun? That's the sort of thing that happens when you have a gun. Now, if you can't handle that, then I'd suggest you don't carry one. I don't know how to feel about that. Like, you didn't want to die, so you had to shoot somebody, but you see they trying to protect their child? I can't believe the little girl went with him. Oh. Is she coming back out? And now she cleaning up after him? I feel like she's on some um like uh some kill bill time. Uh like she's waiting till she gets a little older and stronger to body that nigga. That's not kill bill. What is that? Hannah? Y'all seen Hannah? I'm thinking of a movie. I like movies. I'm not too sure where is that going. Let's let's go to the next. Oh, we're running. Oh. Stardew Valley music. Animal Crossing music. I, I don't think I can sing to this one. Uh, mm, gotcha. No, I can't do it. The beat is too lively and jaunty. They eat the same motherfucking thing every day? How did you hear about this guy, Tenma? about this man Tenma tell me now tell me why in... ah, I'm, all over, I'm all over the place today tell me how you met this man how you found this man Tem Tenma scent that is. It smells just like Daphne Blossoms. Uh, Are these Daphne Blossoms? Okay, I was gonna say, like, there's no way you're lifting up that grown ass man. You are tiny as fuck, but go off. Why are you even watching me, Shorty? I would have been like, what's what's good? All right, that's enough of that. Huh? So then. Time for some more running. Go. Oh, yes, sir. Right away then. When you're done running, come to the bottom of the hill in the back. Uh, what's down there? The firing range. Finally. The firing range. The main reason you came here. Remember, two shots. You have to make sure that whenever you fire your gun, you always pull the trigger twice. If you can do that instinctively, it betters your chances of taking out your objective. If you can't do that, then you're as good as dead. It's all over.
back with it. Hey, hey, Timma shot his first goddamn gun. He got groceries. He's hype. He's making stew with the blicky. Gonna stir it up with the blicky. Hey, ah, he got the roast What's and the this beef about? stew. With You're the always blicky. preparing meals for me, so I thought I would cook for you today. It's a Japanese stew of meat and potatoes. It's called Japan, Nikujaga. Japan, Japan, Go on, Japan, dig Japan, in. I think you'll both enjoy it. With the blicky, hey. Yeah. Those are chopsticks. They're I know what fucking chopstick bread. is. I made them. I thought it would make our dining experience more authentic. How did you make them? I mean, y'all wasn't eating the same motherfucking thing every day. It's nice to have something new. Wow. You're really good at using chopsticks, aren't you? Okay. Again, got fast. the blicky. We got the blicky. Aim. Blicky. Ooh. Do it again. You see the, you see the stand? I see why Aim. he made him train. You got to be strong for that shit. You see how strong he is? Ooh. You see how he is? Oh, they really went into detail with the gun. It's a baby brambling. I guess it fell out of its nest. I guess so. Huh? Where no, are you wait. going? You have to put it back. No, that no. chick is going to die. It's very difficult to raise them like that. They rarely survive for that long outside of the nest. He's right. Don't do this. What's Let's her name? Back. back with its mother, okay? What's his, what, what's her name? Does anybody know? Did he say her name? No, right? What, what sneakers are those, Tenma? Those are Asics, Reebok, Skechers. Seconds. That's all the time you've got. Find your target and pull the trigger, cause one mistake or the slightest bit of hesitation and you're dead. Blicky! Okay! Okay! Woo! We, who we shooting at? But Tell all me, right. How well did he perform over those five months he was there training with you? I thought you wasn't Technically going- Technically speaking, he was a perfect student. Oh. He built up the necessary stamina. And his concentration while firing was extraordinary. However, what? however, being able to actually shoot a person is another story. Really? Whether or not he is successful on his first kill, that's what it all comes down to. Either he's got what it takes, or he doesn't. Yes, I see. I wonder which road this man will choose. Well, it matters not. Tell me, do you have any idea where he might have gone? <laughs> because if you do know where, I would really like for you to tell me. Does it look like I know where the fuck he went? Look at me. He looked at me. And I looked at him. And he looked at me. Thanks for all you've done for me over the past five months. 
Damn. Here's the remaining tuition I owe. Damn. And please help yourself to the Nikujaga. Again, thank you for everything. Damn it. Hmm. You don't have to eat it with that. Damn it all. <laughs> I had a feeling she was going to laugh. So how about it? You do know where this man was heading, don't you? No. Did you not just see that beautiful embrace they just had? He is not telling him. That I can't tell you. Hold on, I got the That's message fine. of that girl laughing. You can go now. I bet. Suck my dick. I don't even know how you found me in the middle of anywhere. Suck my dick. All right, let's go. This way, sir. Thank you, bitch nigga. Let's go. Look at him looking like a freaking eagle. Like he looks like an Asian eagle. It's the little girl playing. Hi, I was making so much fun of you. Do y'all hold hands now? Oh, oh, you crying? I'm about to cry. Bro, I'm about to hit y'all with the most crazy ass theme message, moral, all that shit at the end, bro, because I think we at the end. Do you understand that Tenma spirit, even though Tenma's on like some seeking revenge, trying to find answers his spirit is so good right now he's actually like fixing other people's problems and chakras and shit in the mean in the meantime okay that's a banger right there that was beautiful is there an end part i'm not even gonna watch it i don't even know great job great episode i like this show I like this show a lot. I've been sleeping again. I haven't reacted to this to a minute. But this is cool. I like that um that guy did, well, I don't even know if he did tell him where he was going next. But I like how that guy didn't rat him out. But then kinda rat him out like, yeah, he was there. He was good. I don't know if he's gonna shoot somebody, but yeah, I taught him how to shoot a gun. But that's not excuse me, that's not implicating a goddamn crime. So this, the detective, this detective fucking sucks, yo. He's not even looking at the right answer. And he told him the answer, didn't he? He tried to tell him and he wasn't trying to hear it. He gonna get him because of a fucking tie? I don't understand why Tim and ran, because I would've just been like, yo, this is what happened. And if he didn't believe me, he was about to throw f false accusations at me. Accusations? Um, I would have loved him. I would have been like, I bet. I would have got my lawyer. My lawyer been up your ass because you got me fucked up. And and, and that would have been just the, the, the facts right there. Because you, you going to jail. I ain't going to jail. I'm not getting my booty hole played with. You getting your booty hole played with. My no-no square will be intact by the end of this goddamn interrogation. Yours on the other hand and your badge is gone. Because you fucking around with the wrong one. I'm a doctor. Well, I look like killing people. And then I got hella people vouching for me. You you listen to my ex-wife who, when you went to her house, was downing fucking drinks like a bitch. Like a grown-ass brute in the medieval times. You went to that bitch house and got, told, got, got the answer from her that that was my motherfucking tie. Then she came back to you. Li she lied at first. Talking about she don't know who the fuck that tie is. She could have gave it to anybody. Then she came, got got upset that this nigga didn't want her bitch ass no more. Her ugly little eagle looking little bird looking ass. Then she came back to you and was like, yeah, oh, I do remember. It was 10 months. And you gonna believe that bitch? You not gonna believe the facts that you rated in your head like this? You gonna do that? That don't make sense to me. 
that don't make sense to me. It's okay. Whatever. I don't care. Whatever. That's the end of this episode. I really, I really uh, enjoyed this. I like that the little girl and that old man had a relationship at the end after Tema visited. That shows a lot that Tema is still in good spirits. He really just wants to get his answers down about why Johan and Nina are like kill, going. Well, why Johan is killing all these elderly couples and why who shot the prime minister and all that. And like, why did he come back and kill um, the people, you know, that was overrun overseeing the hospital. I think he just really wants those answers. He's not really trying to get himself in harm's way, but he has to put himself in harm's way to actually get these answers. So he's really just trying training up. So he doesn't get like, you know, get hurt again or some shit. The blicky. So yeah, I really like that. That was cool. I really like that. That was really nice. Okay, that's the end of this. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you guys are watching the other videos because I have so many projects out right now. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to share it with your friends and your family. I'll see you in the next part. Bye. <laughs>